Hello guys, welcome to my channel once again. Please, if you haven't subscribed, consider subscribing so you don't miss any of my videos. Without much ado, let's get started. So we go to create new. Add an illustration. So we're going to select the thousand by thousand pixels. So we're going to create this. Double click on the background layer to unlock it. Okay. Then head over to file, place embedded. And we are going to select this background over here. So we place. And we're going to stretch this. I'm going to stretch this right here. So it's covered the whole of the white screen here. So we'll click the check mark to confirm it. We're going to create a new solid adjustment layer. So we'll have black as our color flow. We'll reduce the opacity down to 50%. Okay. This is okay. I'm going to grab my rectangular tool and draw a rectangle. So we'll change the color flow to yellow. Yeah, this yellow right here. Yeah, it is okay. We are going to rotate this, make it bigger a bit, rotate it again, so we want to place it just beside this, okay, and we click the check mark to confirm it, so we head over to file again, place embedded, and select our next item. So we'll make this bigger and we're going to drop it down. Click the check mark to confirm it. So we'll grab our rulers. You can simply you can simply press Ctrl R to bring the rulers. So we'll grab our test tool and type the word ultimate. Click the check mark to confirm it. Change the color for to white. So we're changing the font to Oxendemibold. Yeah, Oxendemibold. Yeah, yeah. I think this is right. So we'll make it, we'll reduce, we'll increase the size. Mm, this is too big, so we'll reduce it a bit, 16. Okay. So we'll adjust this in the middle right here. Click OK. And we're going to hold Alt and drag to duplicate this test. Select our test tool. Highlight this and change it to function. So we click the check mark to confirm it. We are going to change this font to America and stars. America and stars. Okay, we have it here. We click. We are going to make it title case. We're going to strike this like this. And click the check mark to confirm it. Okay, we send this up a bit. This is okay. So we'll grab our rounded rectangular tool. And we'll draw a shape right here. Change the color flow to yellow. Click the check mark to confirm. So we'll select this test, hold Alt and drag to duplicate. We're going to send this layer up. So we'll select the test tool and edit it. So we'll change it to up to. Click the check mark to confirm it. 
we are going to change this color here to black select the, the, the move tool and we are going to bring it up here in the shape right in the shape so we're going to select our text tool again and type the word and type 50 percent i mean so click to confirm it and we're going to change the color code to yellow okay we're changing the font to accidental presidency okay we have it here so we move and change this size to 72 okay we we'll send it up a bit so we we'll select our rectangular marquee tool and create a shape on the zero we're going to create a shape on this zero right here and click to create a max and we are going to press ctrl i to invent this so we're going to select this text up to hold alt and drag to duplicate so we are editing this and changing the size the, the color to yellow okay to so we'll select the text tool and change this to off click the check mark to confirm and we're going to put it right here so we we'll send this layer to the top put it right here and reduce it a bit okay so we are going to select the rectangular tool and do a rectangle So we change the color to, to yellow. Oh, sorry, I mean black. So we are going to add a stroke. And we change it to yellow. Okay. Please do be to use it. I think four is okay. Okay. So we're going to select the rectangle to and create another right inside again. We will change the color to, to yellow. So we zoom in and, and make this bigger a bit. Click the check mark to confirm. Okay. So I'm going to hold this test and duplicate it again by holding Alt and, alt and drag. So we'll change this test to Ultimate. Change the color to white. Change the test color to white. Okay. So we'll have it here and reduce the size to 9. Okay, good. So hold Alt and drag to duplicate this test. And we are selecting the test tool. We'll change the color tool to black. Okay. So I'm going to select the test tool and change this to trends. We click the check mark to confirm it. So I'm going to hold this shape right here. Hold Alt and drag to duplicate it. Make it a bit bigger. And change the color flow to white. Make it bigger. 
Oke. Okay. Click the check mark to confirm. And we'll hold this trend, hold all trend drag to duplicate. So we'll select the test tool and change this test to shop now. Click the check mark to confirm. So we'll make this title case. Okay. So we'll hold this alt and drag and duplicate. Change the color to white. Change the size to six. We're going to set, grab our text tool and change this to www.designstudio.com. So we'll click the check mark to confirm it. Yeah, this is okay. I'm going to hold this. Yeah, this layer right here, the ultimate. And reduce this size, it's too big. To 12. Yeah, this is nice. Okay. So select this. So we can get rid of our Rolex. Yeah. Then we have it here. Okay guys, thanks for watching once again. See you in my next tutorial.